Hey guys, Nathan here. Uh, today I'm going to show you the last layer algorithms for the LBO pyramid method. Um, in this method, you make a like a layer like that, and I'm not going to teach you how to do that. Um, so you make a layer, and then you solve your last three edges and your center like that. So the first case is this, where all the edges are solved in relation to each other, um, but not to the center. Uh, alternatively, it could look like that. Um, and if it's like this, where you think of the uh, the edges needing to go uh, counterclockwise, like that, so the edges need to cycle like that, um, you do the inverse of that case is where you have the edges need to go clockwise. It could also look like that. Um, so you hold it whichever way you do. The next case is where you have two edges flipped. They're all solved, like they're all permuted, but you have two misoriented. You do the next case, uh, these are the kind of weird ones. Um, and the best way to recognize this is that one like doesn't touch any colors and two have two matching colors like that. And so you want to hold it so that like the V is on the left, um, the V is on the left with the other solved, I mean, the other matching piece right there. And then you do, so the inverse of this is where you have the V on the right and the other matching piece on the left like that. So you hold it like this and you do. So those are all the Pyraminx last layer algorithms you need for this method. Um, this method can get you pretty fast. I'm like around five seconds with it. Um, so yeah, thanks for watching.